Everybody, you dropped the ball. The New York City Sanitation Department is ready to do our job. Hey, Happy New Year! And the Sanitation Department does an extraordinary job. They'll have this place cleaned up tomorrow. I got to show you something. While the commercial was on, I went over to get my water to have a drink. It's frozen. It's almost frozen solid just sitting out here. This is one cold night, but you never know it by looking at the crowd down there. They're having a great time. They're having a great time in New York. They're having a great time around the world. Of course, New Year's have been with us. So look at this temperature. Wind chill factor is three now. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. I have no idea what it was in Hong Kong. The Chinese will be taking over Hong Kong now after 100 years of British domination. They celebrated in Sydney, Australia with gigantic fireworks. And needless to say, as the time zones moved around, we go from Sydney to uh, another very exotic place in the world. You're going to see one of the most famous landmarks, the Kremlin in Moscow. Fireworks on display there in Red Square, and that's Moscow. As we move a little bit uh, further west, we come to London, England. And they brought it in in fine fashion there. You know, the funny thing about it is people come from all over the world right here to the crossroads of the world in Times Square. 23% of the visitors here come from foreign countries and 70 some odd percent of them are between 19 and 35 years of age. But they've been, I watched them out here this afternoon at four o'clock. Now they're slowly beginning to go home. They've been standing there for some of them in excess of seven or eight hours in this bitter, bitter cold. One more set of greetings from our military folks overseas from Japan. Let's let them say hi and hello. Happy New Year's, Dick. Lance Corporal Brian E. Dunlap, Marine Barracks, Kosuke, Japan. I'm Lieutenant J.G. Jennifer Cunningham, and my New Year's wish is for my family to have a safe and happy holiday in Houston, Texas. I'm Operation Special Second Class, Sam Cruz, and my New Year's wish for 97 is for me and my wife, Cynthia, to have a happy and healthy child. My name is EW3 Perry off the USS Hewitt. And my New Year's wish for 1997 is for world peace. You know, I've been thinking about the fact that uh, we have said hello to military people over these past 25 years in the midst of all this celebration. Let's think about some of the interesting, fun things that have happened, aside from the wars and the bad things. We had disco and waterbeds and the Godfather movies and CB radios and pet rocks and Star Wars and Grease and cell phones and CDs and grunge rock and urban cowboys and rollerblades and break dancing and laser beams. Goodness only knows. It's been a pretty good 25 years. And right now, KISS is reunited. I mentioned that the number one concert act, Peter Chris, Ace Frehley, Gene Simmons, Paul Stanley, sold out crowds all over at the Continental Airlines Arena. And in addition, watch the reaction of this Omni audience. They love them. This is KISS on New Year's Eve.
soon. No wonder they are the number one concert attraction of the last year. Last year now being 1996, if you can believe that. That's Kiss. Great show. Going to rock and roll all night. And we're going to continue to rock and roll here on New Year's Rock and Even to 97. With Weird Al, Jan Arden, President of the USA, the Tony Rich Project, there's a lot of good stuff. I got to thinking the other day, we've had one wedding proposal and two weddings here on the show. I'd like to take you back to 1984, see if you remember this one, our first wedding. Up his countenance upon you and give you peace, now and evermore. Amen. Kiss your bride. Hey, there you go. We even, we even got you. There, there's time for... Wayne little, Chu and uh, Vicky Lynn Sanderson back in those days. Take a look at what's happened in the ensuing years. A whole family was... These are our New Year's family. Shana, who's now 10. Mandy, who's 9. Cassie, who's 6. Adam is 4. And they sent me a lovely New Year's card and a great thing to all of the cast and crew saying uh, it's always great to, to spend part of their New Year's with us. To the Chu family, thank you so much. Look what's going on behind me right now. People are going back, trying to get warm, leaving, throwing confetti over the railings. That's up at our uh, number two camera up there on the Marriott Marquis. They're, they're having their own celebration. And down below, people are beginning to drift home. The crowd is cleaning up. These are the diehards. They're still there. They're going to hang in with us. We're going to party all the way into the night, as I mentioned, with Weird Al Yankovic still to come. Miss Jan Arden, and of course the presidents of the United States of America, and again the Tony Rich Project. You, it would appear that the temperature warmed up. I don't know, these people must have generated some heat here. It's up to 16, it was at 13. The wind chill factor is still very cold, but we sure appreciate your joining us. It's the biggest New Year's party in the world, and it happens here at the crossroads of the world, New York's Times Square. Take a look around. 92 years ago, it all started with fireworks being exploded. Nowadays, the skies are filled with beautiful confetti and laser lights, all sorts of modern things, but the spirit still exists. 89 years ago, the first ball drop occurred. And this is our 25th year of New Year's Rock and Eve. And the police have it so beautifully under control. The people have a great time. It's just a good, good way to start the year. And you pick the right spot because we've just begun the party. It's not over. It's uh, dissipating here in Times Square. But stay tuned for a lot of fun on ABC's New Year's Rockin' Eve. 25 years rolling on. We'll be here for the millennium and more, God willing. Don't forget now. Coming up, Weird Al, Jan Arden, Presidents of the United States of America, the Tony Rich Project. No reason to go anywhere, but stay right here for New Year's Rockin' Eve on ABC.